Hello guys, today I'm playing Life is Strange and I listened, this is an awesome game so I have to try it because I love the survival games and I listen this is a survival adventure game and interacted to people and life is really strange so I thought I should try this game So oh, surreal, surreal. Film called film, yeah. little pieces of time. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, just I'm in class. Just Everything's cool. And I am okay. From light to, sh to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. Now, can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black I didn't fall asleep, and that sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller. Weird. Diane Arbus. <laughs> there you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. Shut she saw humanity as tortured, right? So much, and frankly, bitch. it's bullshit. Shh, 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 shh. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. No, 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 it's awesome. Why and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose to capture people at the height of... Shh, shh, shh. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. Yes. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. <coughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always You're been a vital like aspect of art and photography like for as long as it's been around. <laughs> now, Max, bird. since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please Tell us the name but of the process that gave birth to the first self beard is portraits. Looking good. The glasses are also looking good. Oh, wait. Uh, I, I did know. I did but know. I think I forgot. But I kind oh, of yes. forgot. You, you either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, Louis a Daguerre? process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. 
The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular from the 1800s on. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. Self-portrait was done by Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook, or even online. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? No, there's nothing. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard on this shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. I didn't have any time. I didn't have any time. Way too much homework. Max, you're a better photographer than a liar. Now, I, I know it's Don't a drag to hear some old dude Stupid. lecture you, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? But you do have a but gift. You, are doing blah, you have blah, the fever blah, to blah, take blah. images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. And that's what separates the artist from the amateur. Look how they are talking. Definitely a relationship. I kick your butt. Kick your butt like that. Oh, I can't. This is not fair. Oh yes, I can see TV. Look. Man, he even has the best plasma HDTV for a class plasma monitor. HGTV. Can't when wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. Come on, Man, he even has the movies. best plasma HDTV for a class monitor. Okay. Can't wait to watch some more documentaries on this bad boy. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I was about to. I feel like you have you to always welcome to the real world. Just Cute. Hot. Then I might send you a special picture oh, lady, where are you going? Max wants everybody to see how she is. I'm not paying her. She plays it so <laughs> I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Splash water on my face and make sure I don't look like a total loser. I hate that because it's so fucking boring. You are She's so fucking shy. Life is strange and head food can help us. To all of you, American girls, it's sad to imagine a world without you. American girls, I'd like to be part of the world around you. Driving a car by the seaside, watching the world from the bright Empty. side. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. <sighs> <laughs> I can feel how you breathe in, breathe out after seeing this shit. Uh, yes. What is this? Now, who would bother to write that crap? Who bothered to write that? Please. 
splash the water on your face. Yes. Just relax. Mission Stop completed. torturing yourself. You have a gift. Yes, that is a gift. But who give you? Fuck it. Fuck it. Why are you? Why are you doing it? It was good. When a door closes, but a window fly. opens. Or something like that. Fly. Okay, girl, you don't get a photo op like this every day. I think I'm gonna snap a picture of this butterfly. Yes, photo. Close the leaf. Smile on the camera, butterfly. Yes. What this stupid boy doing in the ladies' bathroom? It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. You're the boss. You own this school? So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo-hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? You Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control me! You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs! Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No! It's to kill that woman. <laughs> Whoa! What the fuck? What the how? Fuck how can that be? Oh, no. I was in the bathroom. Back on that class? He shot that, that poor girl. I held up my hand, and then I was back here. These pieces of time can frame us. I already heard this lecture. From light to shadow, from color to curiosity. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's phone rings, this is real. Now, Shit! Can you give me an example of a Damn, photographer? I cannot believe this. Captured the human condition in black and white. Okay, if I'm can crazy, I might as well go all the way. Diane, can I actually reverse time? <coughs> Why Arvis? Because of her images of hopeless faces. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes. I actually did it. Photographer who perfectly captured the human time machine. Anybody? Bueller? Max, don't freak out. Not yet. Victoria? Why Arbus? Because of her images of Keep it together, Max. You feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. When I took my selfie, Jefferson asked me a question. If he does again, I'll know this is for real. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though. I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. So I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? The point Can I save her? Portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, <laughs> since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, I feel sick now. I 
I, I, I have to use the bathroom. I'm sorry, but I really have to, to use the bathroom. Nice try, Max. Uh, but you're not going to get away that easy. I thought that you jerk. We can talk more after Definitely class. Not let me go to the Is there anybody here oh, who shit. knows their stuff? Jefferson wants to keep me after Louis class. Was a French and I need time to save that girl. Types? A process that gave portraits a sharp, ref sharp reflective style like a mirror. The time. Now you're totally Max, stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind the again process, and give him the right answer? And people's faces, the making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular. Since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Yes, I know! Uh, the Daguerrean process? What is this? The Daguerrean process. Daguerian. Invented Daguerian. by a French painter named Louis Daguerre Louis around 1830. Daguerre. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. Yes, I'm definitely Nice work, reading. Max. Don't talk too much. <sighs> The Daguerrean process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far way ahead of everyone. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Max, you are not crazy. You are not dreaming. It's time to be an everyday hero. Yes, everyday hero. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your... I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even think about leaving here until we talk about your entry. Shit. Yes, say what you want. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in her picture. Okay. Uh, I, I'm not awaiting. I'm not sure if I have one. Uh, I'm not awaiting. What are you saying? I'm not avoiding, just... Biding time? Waiting for the elusive right moment? Yes. Exactly. <laughs> Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that life is what happens while you're busy making other plans. Go on now. Don't let me stop you. Yes, Victoria, you still have to do your homework this week. Even if you're submitting your photo... Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? A moment? Yes, excuse you. No, Victoria, excuse us. I'd never let one of photography's future stars avoid... John Lennon C. Okay. I can't be in two places at once. What's going on here? Something... I definitely can't stop here. Something messing up. I have to save that girl and this stupid person not leaving me. Are you wasting that time?
I see you, Max Caulfield. Don't even th think about leaving. About leaving. Her stars avoid handing in her picture. Not sure if I have one. Uh, yeah, I'm not sure I have one. Given your selfie output, I'm sure you must have about a thousand pics by now. It'll take a long time to find a good one. Max, don't wait too long. John Lennon once said that light. Now that I'm gonna listen to this today again, I have to save that woman. Please don't stop me now. I hope I have enough time to get to the bathroom. Please, please. I can't tell anybody. They'll think I'm crazy. Okay, Max, retrace every step. I washed my face. I shredded my photo. Then the butterfly flew in. And I took a photo. And then, that's stupid. Leave them out of this bitch! I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come Don't on, put that thing down! Tell me what to do. Browser, it's happening again. I need a hammer to break it open. Hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! Oh, holy shit, I can't let this happen. If I can reverse time again, I can help her. I wonder how we'll get around this. Gun away from me, psycho! Oh! Never tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? Get that gun away from me, psycho! No way! Don't ever touch me again, freak! Another shitty day. And that did not I happen. This cannot be real. I just saw a girl get shot and then saved her. What the fuck is going on? Do not freak out. What the hell? Hey, do you hear that fire alarm? That means you should no. be outside. I had to I use the bathroom. What? What Girls always about? use that excuse. Excuse for what? For whatever you're Excuse up to. Your face is covered in guilt. The alarm tripped me out. Then trip on out of here, Missy. Or are you hiding something? Huh? Thank you, Mr. Madsen. The situation is under control. There's no emergency here. Leave Miss Caulfield alone and please turn off that alarm since that's your job. <laughs> Don't make stupid face now. Go to the hell So where should I go now? Don't wander around here. Get on outside. Yes, I'm going. Thanks. Thank you for telling me where from. Go outside. Thank you, old belt man. You saved me. You Speak. look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm, no, I'm, just, I'm fine. just a little worried I'm about, my about my future. future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all you're thinking about? You can always be up front with me, Max. Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. Don't scare me, old man. Uh, uh, hide. Uh, no, 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 hide the truth. If I tell him. I just got sick in class. Believe in me. Um, uh, female trouble. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's just class. Just tell me what you're hiding. 
You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team toot again. You know, I've, I've heard enough. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Now get outside with class. Thank Please. you. Please. Thank you for insulting me so much. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Yes, I could rewind and actually tell him the truth. I could... It mean... Hold on, Max. Yeah. Come back here. As I thought you will call me back. Now what? You look a little stressed out. Yes, I'm Both. What? You look a little stressed out. I just saw Nathan Prescott waving a gun around in the girls' room. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be there. It's the girls' room. I know. I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family. And one of Blackwell's most no, honored he's still students. Not with me. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girls' bathroom. So what happened next? Then. then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you gonna bust him? This is a serious charge. I'll look into the matter personally. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told you? We'll continue this discussion. Later, in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class now, Miss Caulfield. What a fear. Of course this academic drone won't do anything, since the Prescott family owns...